Good afternoon, I'm Sarah Haynes, and here are the top four stories buzzing online right now. Coming in at number four, Chris Pratt has become one of the hottest leading men in Hollywood, looking insanely cut for Guardians of the Galaxy and fit enough to run from dinosaurs in Jurassic World. But now the funny man is getting serious about some hard times during his heavyweight days. The world fell in love with Pratt, as did I, as Andy Dwyer on the hit show Parks and Rec, while he was gaining stardom, the role also required him to pack on the LBs. But he felt fatigued and had real health issues, so he instantly did something about it. Now he says, quote, I've never seen myself funnier. Good for him, because we all know that's not easy. And as if there was ever any doubt, Betty White has proven once and for all that she's the coolest 93-year-old of all time. It's official. Betty White is on Instagram. In honor of the series finale of her TV show, Hot in Cleveland, Betty posted this photo to her brand new Instagram account saying, for my first Instagram post, I wanted to say how much I love these girls dearly. What a great time we had. Hashtag hot finale. Hashtag thanks for the laughs. The Golden Girls star already has over 77,000 followers and growing. They must have had Instagram back in St. Olaf because those hashtags of hers are on point. You go, girl. Coming in at number two, this is for all you One Direction fans who want more Harry Styles than you can handle. If you love literature and One Direction, I've got the perfect Twitter account here. Harry as Books. The lead singer stars in some of the greatest works of fiction, and the resemblance is uncanny, isn't it? You can even submit requests to Harry as books and founder Emily will do her best to rustle up a perfect cover just for you. And finally, if you're struggling to get to the weekend, I promise no one feels your pain more than this little guy. An adorable armadillo heading over to the ramp at the Mulhouse Zoo in France. Look at this little guy. The struggle is real. His little legs scrambling there as he tries to climb. He keeps trying. He won't give up. Finally, he throws in the towel. I mean, there's always tomorrow, Mr. Armadillo, but I feel you. That feels more like a Monday to me, though. Be sure to tune into GMA for more pop news tomorrow. For ABC News, I'm Sarah Haynes in New York. Have a great day.